What's good with y'all boys man, it's your boy Asperge and in today's video I'm going to be showing you guys 5 VC methods on how to get more VC in NBA 2K23 But before we get into it, make sure to like and subscribe We're on the road to 5k subs and let's get right into it Make sure y'all watch the whole video through so you don't miss any steps Because I know y'all trying to be like me, I'm almost up 500k without buying any VC Alright, so we're going to start off with the easiest methods possible and we're going to work our way up to the harder ones They get more VC. So the first one is really simple and easy. Daily pick them, come over to this cart in the promenade. They have these on next gen too. They're by like the event center and stuff. So literally you just got to pick the two next games. I think the Lakers got this one and definitely the Bucks got this one. So we're going to go ahead and submit this just little free vc not too much you can usually get up to around like anywhere from like 100 to 1000 vc it's literally free vc so there's no point in not doing this and yeah all right for this method it's not really a method but you can do this once a day and you usually get vc at least once every week so it's just a daily spin um i got a i got two hours of xp which is pretty good still but it's a VC video, but you can usually plan on getting anywhere from like 500 to like, I've gotten 15K VC on here before. Um, so you can plan on usually getting anywhere from 500 to 15K VC a week, really solid. Um, you usually get it once or twice a week, but um, let's get into the next one. All right, so the next method is the endorsement method. If you already don't know, endorsements are the best way to get VC um, well one of the best ways anyway so just come over to this place right here if you play lots of micro you usually get like ruffles deals Gatorade deals Mountain Dew deals anything like that just make sure you put the VC high as, high as possible um, don't worry about the um, incentives I mean you can do that if you plan on just grinding those incentives but the best way is just putting the endorsement VC up as high as possible all right, so for this next method here, we got the my career method. This is probably one of my favorite methods, and I usually do it to get a lot of VC. Um, so what you want to do is, if you're not already on a bad team, try to sign to a bad team that usually doesn't make the playoffs. And so you can usually just sim seasons and get a higher VC contract. You do want to play a few games, so you do have a good role. So you do get the higher contracts. You can usually get anywhere from like you can get really up to like 2000 vc a game and the best way to do that is to sim to far in the years like as you can see i'm in january uh 2025 actually so i simmed i'm on like my second or third season i think but then once you want to then you want to get to like your third fourth season or whatever you can do second too but you'll get more as the more seasons go on so once you do that you want to start a game and then you want to do this all right so f what you want to do now is you want to start up the micro game in your second third or fourth season it does not matter you don't have to be a starter you can be a reserve player or, or bench player or whatever it does not matter but anyways you just want to start the game um as you can see it's just the first quarter i just barely subbed in you just want to play till about eight or nine minutes i believe until you get the to the point where you can sim out with vc um this is a little bit time consuming but it doesn't take that long and it's worth it in the long run you can usually rack up around 50 to 100 kvc a day as you can see by the beginning of the video i had over 400,000 vc i did not buy it you guys don't have to believe me but um i had over 400,000 vc just from doing methods saving vc i don't really buy that much clothes but this is just the best best method that i think it is the best method anyways but um i'm gonna catch you guys as soon as i can sim to end with vc all right so once you get to the end make sure you sim to end with vc and i should get anywhere from around a thousand to two thousand vc um as you can see i didn't my stats weren't that good and i did play 10 minutes i thought it was eight so you just gotta play two extra minutes it is 10 minutes by the time it popped up for me so i didn't have the best game but i still got about 14 1400 vc um with like i don't even really have that much incentives i had as you can see i think it added like 20 and like 45 vc 
and then you just got to go through these cutscenes, and you just want to keep doing this as many times as possible you can rack up around once again 50 to 100 kvc as long as you keep doing this consistently even though it's mad boring you just got to keep doing it and you can't give up all right so for the last step this is the fastest way you can get vc you can get up to 450 kvc in seconds um me personally i do not do this method um a bunch of my friends do this method i do not do it because it's it's basically stealing but it's called the refund method you guys have probably heard of it but anyway you just want to go ahead choose any of these vc amounts go ahead and buy it do whatever and then you want to go ahead and call your bank account and tell them that i did not buy this and they'll give you a refund so you basically basically get any of these for free once again i do not do this method i don't recommend you guys do it but if you guys ever need vc really badly you guys can go ahead and do the refund method there are tutorials out there on how to do this method um, i'm not going to be showing it because i don't do it i'm just going to put it in the video in case you guys are really that in need of vc but um i think i showed the other better methods that you can do by actually playing the game and stuff but this is the last resort if any of you guys need this so uh yeah all right man appreciate y'all watching um i appreciate everyone that made it this far in the video once again make sure to like and subscribe and join my community discord to know whenever i'm going live or whenever i'm about to post a video i usually let everyone in there know about five minutes before so you guys get noties within noties if you know what i'm saying that link will be in the description i appreciate everyone we're on the road to 5k subs make sure you sub up with noties on if you haven't it's your boy ashbridge i'm out peace